All right, this one is pretty special. If you're if you are from the '80s or remember the '80s, uh, if, you know it was about at the time he had already I would say passed his prime. But this shoot is uh, was done. When was this done? June sixth, nineteen eighty nine. This one's really old in Los Angeles. Here, this was a great job, a great shoot for with the amazing artist Adam Ant. Adam was you know. A big deal in the 80s, in the mid to early 80s, I guess, when he had, you know, he was running around with his makeup on and all this crazy stuff. But this shoot was for his album cover, Manners, I think it's called Manners and Physiques. This was the cover shoot. So the joy of this shoot and the amazing part of this session was I did this shoot for Norman Moore. And you're saying to yourself, who the fuck is Norman Moore? So Norman Moore was a big time creative director, art director in Los Angeles. I don't know if he's still around. Um, but if you look him up or you look at his work, he's done so many iconic album covers. It's ridiculous. I first learned of him and saw his work when he did. He designed the album cover for the Police Synchronicity, the blue, yellow, red swashes over the amazing Dwayne Michael photos. That's that's when I met him, and I think I was probably I don't know 23, 24 years old. But years later, I got to do this shoot for him, my first shoot for him, and Norman was just one of the best designers. I ended up doing probably three, four covers shoots for him. And just an amazing. We did this shoot at um, PRS Studios on Melrose and in Hollywood. It, uh, the old PRS, which was the photo rental service, once they moved out of Melrose, they created a, a small studio space and we rented that day place for the day. They use these pictures for publicity and marketing for the album cover. I ended up shooting him years later for Cream Magazine. I did a fashion shoot with him and a model that I love to this day. One of my favorite fashion shoots that I ever did with him and because he's just Mr. Style and the model was drop dead gorgeous. I think her name was Vanessa. Uh, but it was a great shoot and shooting for, you know, shooting for Norman Moore honestly was like at that time was probably the biggest, biggest moment of my career because Norman, he's a legend in the design world. And now because of this, I'm probably gonna go look up and see if he's still around. But this was a great shoot, Adam Ant. 1989.